Afi, your, uh, what's your role here at Brisbane Adventist College? Um, <laughs> what are you? What do you do here, man? <laughs> I'm in director of sports. <laughs> cool. Um, you've had Aussie hoops in the school now for two years, is that right? Yep. And and how? What's what's your feedback? What's what's it done for your basketball program? Um, we have a few programs here at the school, and I'd like say that Aussie hoops has been the, the most successful in regards to uh, student participation and, and individual growth and love for the game. Yep. Um, you saw the kids are out there had have some games today, um, and you got a student, so you, uh, sorry, uh, teachers versus uh, local QBL players. Um, how's that going to go off? Do you think? Well, we're going to have the whole primary school here. It's going to be crazy. Um, everyone's been looking forward to it for the last two weeks. So my understanding is, you of them have done signs and, and a few cheers. So looking forward to it. This should be fun. All right, we'll get some clips for it, and uh, we'll put it up on. Uh, on our uh, Aussie Hoops page. Thanks. Cheers. Okay, you're uh, you're suiting up for the BAC staff sure, against sure. the uh, the QBL team from the Pirates. How, how do you think you're going to go? Um, well, last year we smashed them, so we're looking to do the same again this year. So you smashed them. Smashed them, yeah. It wasn't even close. <laughs> is that is that contradictory to what uh, I've been told from from last year? So. Don't believe anything that you're told. You need to hear it from me. Okay, all yeah, good. Sure. All right. So where where do you think your strengths lie against um, the Pirate team? Well, our strengths lie in um, we play a very unconventional game that they're not used to. Yeah, the Thanks. professionals can't handle our, our style of playing, so yeah. Cool. All right. Yeah. Well, good luck, yeah. and uh, yeah, we'll hope to get some clips up for you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> hey, guys, uh, excited about the big game today? Yeah, we're pumped, we're ready to go. All right, you've got to match up against uh, six foot four Erica Carlson. How do you think it'll go? Uh, yeah, my mum always told me to um, use what she told me, gave me something on a box. Her out. All right, I'm sure she's shaking in her boots. Um, any uh, any words of advice for the opposition? These two are real nervous. Oh, Speechless. Oh, there we go.
right, you guys played your uh, your first So You Think You Can Play game. Uh, Ryan, how'd you find it? I mean, it didn't play too well, but uh, was, was a big fan of the, the crowd and the good atmosphere we had going. Yeah. All right. And the the level of competition, the standard competition in So You Think You Can Play, uh, uh, do you think you're up for it? I'm up for it, yeah. It was, it was better than I thought it would be. Yeah. Uh, they got a couple buckets we shouldn't have allowed, but they were good. They were good. Mr. Ish? Mr. Lama got pretty lucky on some of those shots, I think. I've never seen it. I've never seen a ball go through the hoop and leave his hands, but happened yeah. a few times. Pretty stiff competition. They, were, they played us down to the wire, but you know we came out with a few more dunks in him. So. Okay. All good. All right. Congratulations, guys. Did, uh, did you get the win or did you lose? Did, did we win? They got the win. The kids oh, we, won. we narrowly won. They won. Barely. No. Barely. Okay. Congratulations. We'll wait for game six. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I don't have a pen on me. Maybe we can use her as well. Ask, ask um, Mr. Lama. Ask Mr. Lama. He'll have a pen. Hey, Mom. Hey, Thanks for coming. Hello. Oh, thanks, guys. Thanks for coming. You're number 12. Oh, I don't know if we're going to game. Oh, I'm going to everywhere.